Jay, explain what happened because I'm an idiot. Nathan's an idiot, and he decided to put his uh, start capture and stop capture key on something that you use for math. So, a lot Caleb, happened. <laughs> Willem Rose, uh, even though Nathan marked him and decided to turn around, take the penalty, and unleash his... Uh, no, no, AJ, even before that. Oh my god, when? When? Okay, I only did my strike. Caleb was still fighting bandits. Oh my, Nathan. <laughs> Do math in your head from now on, jeez. I was right. Okay. I was changing it on the thing so that it kept track. You dumb. Anyways, the mayor died. And he Nathan, you could change it the token. I did that. I literally hit it, and I did minus nine. Yeah, but just do the math in your head. Like, you have 31 right now. Oh, you take two damage, put in 29. Don't put in negative two. Okay, anyways, Caleb was overfighting the bandits. Uh, one, the bandit in front of him decides that he's going to focus on the villagers instead. And it's Caleb's turn. He looks at the villagers, and he's like, you guys, we're going to sell on my friend. All my family's dead. He's the only thing I got left. I'm going to go help him. So he goes over and he attacks Willem Rose and he joins the battle. Uh, the mayor uh, decides that he, instead of running, he was going to also help. I don't know if he got that. So he uh, attempted to take on some bandits. He actually deflected their maces back at them using a Shoryu belly. Uh, but then uh, this guy right here came up behind him and sliced off his head. And all the lubber, blubber side of him fell out like he was Oogie Boogie. Uh, Willem Rose got annoyed so he decided to take the penalty of the mark, turned around towards Caleb unleashed his orcish fury uh, because he has he's a descendant of an orc he's, got like, he's an eighth orc and uh, he just slashed up Caleb Caleb went down with negative one health but he made a roll when it came around to his turn and he's now stabilized so Nathan through, can sheer through sheer determination through sheer determination Nathan now has plus three to all of his defenses and attack rolls because determination. Nathan, how much did you care for the mayor? You could get four if you give me convincing enough argument. I mean, he stayed and fought, so pretty much a lot. Okay, Nathan, you get plus four to all your attack rolls and AJ, defenses. Are you sure you want that? Maybe not. Never mind. <laughs> okay. And... <laughs> You've pissed me off so much that I'm doing comeback strike, which really doesn't make any sense because I'm not really that. Wait, injured. it's not your turn yet. I thought it was. I thought you just said it was my turn. No, it's uh the, the bandits. Bandit seventeen. Can't you see the turn order? Okay, I'm going back to soccer spirits. Okay, bandit hits him. Next bandit goes up, hits him. Uh. Cycle all the way through to you. I'll just move these guys how I feel like it. Bleh. Bleh. Also, mechanical rhythm. Yes. Okay. Mm. One, two, three, four, five, six. So, the orc has joined the fight, and it's your turn. Congratulations, Nathan. Oh boy. Okay, so I roll my daily. Plus three. Okay, you hit him. Wow, 23 damage. And you can spend a healing surge. Do you heal yourself? Yeah. Uh, I'm doing math in my head. However, now I am going to type that. Oh. Uh, let's see. Oh man, you're almost there. Okay, Willem Rose turns back around and <laughs> he sees uh, the orc over here. Hold on. Uh, oh, no, never mind, that's right. Okay. I was sure they were twice. Sees the orc over here and he. Uh, right. This guy is apparently tough. It's tougher than I thought. Help me with this. 
And the orc just kind of grunts and turns towards you. And Willem Rose is in the duck. Oh man, he doesn't manage to hit you. You managed to block it. Through sheer determination. No, he wanted if you've gone through your base defense, I think. He just got he got a horrible roll. Yeah, he got a really bad roll. Okay, uh Villager. Okay, I would turn down the music just ever so slightly. There we go. Villager's dead. Uh can Caleb make some other roll to further stabilize himself? Healing surge. Oh man, he can use the healing surge? Oh, oh man, how do you use healing surges again? <laughs> oh my god, look it up. Do I have to roll, or do I just... I mean, I can see his healing surge value. Does I Do I just add that to his health? Nathan! Yeah. We get the I just roll add it to it. his health. You get the roll and for I, it. What do I roll? I don't fucking know. You're, he you're d20 and then heal. I just realized I probably could use those magical band-aids on you. I mean, do you really want to? It's a minor action. You are correct, I think. You said so. Well, geez, I don't remember everything I say. I wrote it down just to make sure there'd be no arguments. Oh boy. Alright, uh, I've learned from playing with Jeremy to write things okay, down. He he spends an action sur or healing surge. I don't think he needs to roll anything. Doesn't sound like it. So he is now at five health because he is horrible at uh, the health. Okay, uh, and that was the standard action, so he can't really do anything right now. Uh, bandits. Uh, we'll just cycle through all the bandits and say that all the villagers are now dead, and it is your turn. Oh, wait a second, the orc was supposed to go. Never mind. Um... Okay, and the max damage she can deal, because he got a crit, is uh, 15. To me? The, indeed. The This orc right here. He got a crit. I suddenly can't see my health anymore. Hmm... Why are you at 39 out of 37? That is a great question. 37. And then that, so... 22? Yes. Did you overheal yourself or something? Yeah. <laughs> Sheer determination. Oh man, is it? Huh? Sheer determination. Yeah. Okay. Uh, it's still, it's your turn. I'm gonna finish this fucker off. Okay, I mean, you used da your daily on him already, so I don't... Okay. And I say that because you make it sound like you're gonna kill him here. Like in this turn. In this moment. This second. Which you will never forget. <laughs> you got a critical failure on damage. Does that matter? No. Okay, you managed to break through his guard. And yeah. then I also do... Oh, and then you are also dealing 7 damage to the orc? Uh, it's 4 damage, I think. It's my, uh, strength. It's my strength modifier. Oh, well, you, 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 didn't, you didn't put that there in the description. 
Okay, so you're dealing four damage to him. Okay. Uh, the orc now looks angry. Because you attacked him. Technically, I just did a very wide swing. You uh, are sensing malicious intent and believe a strong attack is coming next turn. <laughs> okay, Azriel, I'll get ready. Okay. Oh, oh man. Of oh, dreams. <laughs> Nah, no, this isn't the moment for that. <laughs> this is definitely not the moment for that. This is obviously the moment for Megalovania. Do I even have that on here? Are you kidding me? This is not a Megalovania moment. When I was first planning uh, him talking, he was supposed to say you're going to have a bad time if you don't give him to me. <sighs> Get done. Anyways, one of those turn. Uh, and... He... I'm wondering if he would just like turn back around and slice that Caleb again or not. <laughs> hmm. So you're marking him every turn? Yep. Guess I'm not. I think I can. Yeah. I can just keep marking him. And I'm going to until he dies. Oh man, all the villagers are dead. Indeed. You weren't even paying attention to me saying that they're all dead. Nope. Rude. Okay, uh, Wilmros, uh, glances over his shoulder and sees Kale's back up. He's like, God damn it, why don't you die? And then he turns back around and slices again. And Caleb is now at negative six health. And it goes back down. Damn. Uh, bandits. What do they do here? I mean, there were supposed to be other. There's the whole village, you said, so I'm assuming they're just still slaughtering. Okay, yeah, they. Uh, let's just pretend they go off on a journey. Of adventure and discovery. <laughs> Self discovery. Of, of pillaging. Of pillaging. Okay, Caleb, <laughs> roll a d20. Seven. He stays down. Bandits, 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 bandits. He bandits. also, his health goes to negative seven. Oh, he loses. Oh, he's bleeding out? Yeah, he loses one health per failure, and if he gets to negative ten, he loses. I believe. I thought it was. I thought it was half of your max health. Oh, maybe it is your max. What is your max health? Uh, I think it's twenty-two. <laughs> so it's negative eleven. <sighs> Anyways, orc bandit time. Uh, you made him angry, so he is going to roll. Come on, do I have any? Uh, yeah, this one. Uh, okay, that hits you. What was the damage? And he's also doing a strong, so that is GM roll. Uh, uh, uh. Don't forget my thing is plus three. So mm. it's, it's Twenty. Yeah, he, he still hits you. Damn. I know, right? He's just getting. He, he got a pretty good roll. He got an, he, got, he rolled an eighteen. Uh, and then he's using his Furious Assault. Wow! Good job on your uh, ultimate attack, man. You're really good there. Okay, so, uh, he attacks you with his Battle Axe. And he puts in uh, a little more effort and takes a second swing at you. But you kind of got into a rhythm and managed to kind of dodge the last one. So you only take 16 damage. I'm bloodied. You're indeed. Uh, I so I have 4 health? Uh, no. You have 6. 6. Okay, and hit this enter. There we go. Good job. Your turn. 
Well, I'm fucking screwed. Um, why can't I see his health bar? Uh, going for a cleave again. Gotta go for that cleavage. So, 21. Uh, remind me, do matches hit or do they not? They bounce off. Unless bounce role off. plays. And when it says role play, role play says otherwise. Well, he is facing away from you right now, so... Well, then my attack will be plus two. Okay, then, yeah, he, you hit him. Okay, uh, he takes a swing at you, and he's, he's in the middle of turning around, so he doesn't block it entirely and whatever, so he takes damage. Eight damage plus uh, four to the orc. Okay. Uh, Willem Ross. Oh, also I heal myself. Oh, man. With my item thing. Okay. I'm down to... Three. Willem Ross is officially bloodied. How much does those heal me by? Uh... Was it a healing surge? Yeah, it was a healing surge worth. How much is one of my healing surges? Nine, okay. Fifteen. Woo. You know, you really need more music. <laughs> I was just checking it. Ah, okay, let's go with Proud Nyota again. <laughs> okay, one Ross. He looks at you. Yeah, and he doesn't even have any words at this point. He just wants to get this over with. Again, AJ, Jeez. I'm not going to win. Uh, well, if he uh, keeps getting bad rolls like this, then he will. I still have to Can deal he... with the orc. Uh, well, and I'm all about... the bandits. I'm about, I'm about to get to that. Willem Ross <laughs> takes a swing at you, but you manage to whoosh, dodge to the side. He, f he trips, and his... Uh, sword ends up striking the orc because he got a uh, critical failure wow good job Willem Rose you're supposed to be a seasoned adventurer and bandits Caleb uh, wait, what happens if I just say d20 Darn. and he goes down another Cycles all the way through. Orc Bandit. Uh, <laughs> the Orc Bandit looks at uh, Willem Ross kind of annoyedly. But uh, he goes over to you. Just, actually, you know what? Here. Let's let's have this fun. Let's make this fun. Let's roleplay this. I'm going to roll against the Orc's will. And if I roll higher... Then he uses this turn to take a swipe at Wilmros. Uh, is that higher? It is not. Okay. Well, he doesn't, so he is attacking you. Uh, where is my thing? That one. Okay, uh, the orc does not manage to hit you. You manage to uh, block it. What is your turn? Really? You sure? Yes, I am pretty sure this time. You sure? You're a hundred. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Ooh, the hell's this? This is the remix for the home port <laughs> for Contact Collection. It's under random fight music. Anyways, yeah, your turn. Hey, you're actually okay. doing pretty good, Nathan, if I do say so. I mean, you are almost dead. 
but you you've dealt quite a bit of damage to these guys. Yeah, you know, for just I getting mean, my did, but... just getting my ass handed to me, jumping into my most deadliest fear, losing my best friend, losing my father figure, losing my mayor of my village, giving turning my back on most of the villagers, and now my friend is probably close to near death. Nathan, I'm doing pretty okay. Nathan, I just want you to know. During, as Lon's turn comes around, all those thoughts flash through his mind, and he gains a <laughs> he gains a burst of rage. <laughs> for this for this attack, you get plus five to your attack roll. Good job. <laughs> Channel that rage. I mean, AJ. No matter what, I'm probably gonna kill one of these fuckers, but I'm not gonna survive the other. <laughs> do you do you not recall? Uh, this guy being like, uh, take this one alive, kill the others. You're not, you're not, it's not that you're not going to survive. They'll just take you alive. It's always been the plan. So, 25? Uh, indeed. Okay, man. And then four to the orc. <laughs> you just keep using clean. Uh, okay. Wow. Okay, well, Ambrose. The Rose looks, once again, thoroughly annoyed. Uh. His, his stuff doesn't have. He's not dead uh, yet? No. Dude, he was an elite. Fuck? What level is he? Nathan? This is so fucking stupid. <laughs> I'm so mad at you right now. He's, you did not listen to me at all today when I was talking to you. Nathan, I planned this all a while ago. I didn't have time to change anything. <laughs> you are literally can improvise anything. Turn this music down. Oh man, where is it? Where is it on here? There? Uh, I just feel like I'm complaining this whole game. This just isn't fun. There's no sense of victory, there's a sense of dismay and loss. Dude, being main character is despair. No, no it's not. Stop being a bitch. Well, congratulations, Nathan, you just got a critical. How? I just rolled for his attack, and he got a critical. So I'm he rolled, dead. He, ro he rolled a twenty, or he rolled max for both of them. So I'm dead. Uh, well, technically, you are now on the borderline of death. <laughs> I'm at two. You are at two. <laughs> Can Caleb show up to save you at the last moment? No, he's in negative sixteen. No, he cannot cycle all the way through Orc Bandit. Uh, he takes... He sees that you are bloody. It fills him with bloodlust. And he strikes you. You rolled a five, sir. No, the five was for Caleb reviving. Oh. Okay, the Orc slides up behind you. Congratulations, Nathan. It's over. And to Will Ambrose. Or AJ? Will Ambrose. AJ. What? AJ? What? Again. Was I supposed to lose here? I made backup plans if you won. Stop doing this! This isn't fun! This is the last time, Nathan! I told you! This is the last, uh... You should lose, but if you win, it's fine. I have a backup plan. This is the last one. We just literally wasted like three hours doing this. This is not three hours. Two. Hey, at least we had some good music. Oh, yeah, and now we're out. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, the orc comes up behind you, 
And instead of attacking you with a sword, seeing that you're kind of like dazed and all of that, he just boom, just punches you in the back of the head and you go down. So much for like, burying Amber. Huh? So much for burying Amber. Indeed. So much indeed. And as you fall down, Lomaros goes over to Caleb and he's like, you little shit. And he takes out his sword. He gets a critical because that's how things apparently work with the things. And he sticks it right through his chest, dealing 13 damage. Caleb is dead as well. Wait, what? AJ, <laughs> you are literally making Akume got kill now. Nathan. I literally just... Do you want me to take a photo of the, him getting a critical? It doesn't matter. You killed the main character. No, Nathan. You're the main character. He was the hero. You killed the hero. Don't worry, Nathan. There's a replacement. <laughs> Don't you know these things grow like... Grow on trees. <sighs> and with that, he... Uh, wipes his blood off on his clothes... On Caleb's clothes, wastes the blood of his sword. On Caleb's clothes, that's what I was saying. My sword. Just uh, nudges his face a little bit with his boot, turns around, uh, looks at you, and then just starts walking. <laughs> Bring it back to base and make sure you uh, kill every other villager. And then he walks off. Why the hell do you want? They want me so much. Why, indeed. Okay, stop this music, AJ. Clearly, the battle's over. I mean, you're right. Time for some chillin' music. Yeah. Well, that's some sad music. That's not sad. <laughs> Give me a moment. There we go. We'll go with this again. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, at the beginning, that if I sound like a bitch, it's because I'm not happy with AJ. If, no, you should say if you sound like a bitch, then it's only because I am a bitch. Anyways, uh, you're on the verge of blacking out, and as uh, everything gets dark, you roll your head over. So look back at the village and you see it starting to rise into flames with these jerks over here. Uh, you know, doing the fire. Oh man, if we won, I was going to catch the village on fire. You were going to set it on fire because everybody wanted to give you up? Yep. Wow. I honestly was actually going to do that. I was thinking okay. about it this whole time. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I agree. I, they were going to give you up. That's a perfectly acceptable a thing for somebody who is not a hero. I am no hero. You are just a bystander. <sighs> Anyways, uh, oh, man, forget I got this an place. evolution. Huh? I got an evolution. Oh man, congrats. From my level fives. Okay, as. Uh, and you end up waking up. What was your max health again? 37. 37. I'm just gonna put you at max health because you were out for a while. And, uh, uh, yeah, you wake up and you notice that you're actually kind of feeling okay physically because they seem to have dressed your wounds. Was I their chosen hero? Was I the Dark Lord? Am I prophesized to be the Demon Lord, AJ? To bring genocide to the universe? Oh man, how did you know? I can't tell if you're joking or not. Oh darn, I missed. Okay, give me one. Do you know. Do you recognize <laughs> where we are? No, I can't see anything. You scroll oh, down to the bottom oh, left. Oh, yep. I'm where Tegan was. Yep. 
Uh, uh, if you look across the thing, you can uh, still see that the door is broken. From sheer and determination. Through sheer determination. And so they apparently decided to put you in the more secure one. Good. You also see that it seems to be reinforced. Even more. Good job. Wait a second. I and there's no guards, to... so I can't intimidate the piss out of them. Well, give me a moment. Dang. I just needed to copy... AJ, it, if uh... you give me a guard, I'm intimidating it. Uh, just give, give me a moment. Okay, you hear footsteps. Coming through the hallway. And then Jinx, Amber's alive. <laughs> yeah, here I am. I still have negative health, though. <laughs> so I'm still dead. And then it turns out that she's actually a succubus and she was scouting you to become the Demon Lord. No. <laughs> Not at all. Dang it, AJ. Okay. Can't I have a little happiness in this game? <laughs> Being main character is despair. Okay. Uh, Willem Ross uh, looks at you through the bars and he's like, You feel uncomfortable? Go to hell. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's understandable. After all, they just slaughter your entire village. And my family. And my friends. And anyone that I hold dear to me. Go on. Well. Also. I don't really have much to say to you. Just make sure you stay in that cell this time. Sure. Huh? What are you doing? I was intimidating him. Are you... What, what do you have? I got a 15 so and my intimidate is plus 7, so it's 23. Okay, let Wait, me no, look. Wait, no, 22. Let me Versus look at his uh, page. I will just close Caleb. <laughs> Forever. <sighs> Lambros looks at you as you glare at him. And he's like, I have seen shit, man. Or boy. Don't think that you could intimidate me. A guy who has never even won a single real fight. Burn! <laughs> what? Burn. Yeah. Oh man, you need some aloe vera. Do you need me to get a nice pack for you? Give me Juvia. Anyways. Stat. Anyways, make sure that you actually stay in the cell this time. Make sure to reinforce it. And because obviously, just tell me to make make sure it's reinforced. I know. I said we reinforced it. Not. He was telling you to stay inside the cell this time. Ah, oh, okay. And just in case, if you haven't learned your lesson already, I will be the one keeping guard this time. So don't try anything. All you have to do is stay there for uh, a few more hours, and then we'll be done with you. The hell and you he walks off me. No, he. Oh wait. Yeah, okay, you say that before he finishes walking away. Just seems like he's about out of sight. He says, We don't want anything with you, but she does. Do, do, do. She? And... Is the uh, idol no. the bad guy? <laughs> no, man, he's <it's> <laughs> not kidding. No. <sighs> God damn it. So. I'm a funny uh, guy. Funny joke. Okay, funny and, he joke? and he walks out of sight before you can ask that and you don't hear a reply. And he hears footsteps fade. So, uh... You decided to just sit there? Yep. You do? What the fuck am I gonna be able to do? It's hopeless. Wait. Wait. What? What? Checking my dungeoneering skill. 14 versus a probably hard challenge to see if there's any sort of secret walls or passages or some shit. 
Wait, so that's what you just rolled? You got a 14 and adding your Dungeoneering? And it's zero, so I only get a 14. Oh. So I lose. Well, uh... You don't see anything. So I sit back against the wall, put my hands behind my head, and resist the, the temptation to cry myself to sleep. I think you lost. <laughs> what the hell is that? What? Oh, against... <laughs> <laughs> AJ! <laughs> That's pretty funny, dude. Yeah, I don't write. Despair. Absolute despair. Okay, so you uh, fall asleep. And then, uh, what seems like, I don't know, how fast does time pass for despair? I don't fucking know. Okay, what well, seems like. Uh, That's Monokuma. An uncertain amount of time, you wake up to hear more footsteps. Seems like a pair of them. E boop, 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 boop. The hell is that thing? Uh, you see Willem Rose uh, walk down the hallway with a female in robes, and she has a staff with her. She looks at you, and then she looks at Willem Rose. So this is him? So this is him? Yeah, Tegan said it was him. Or that guy. The guy said it was him. Also, you didn't even ask where Tegan was. Wow, rude. Oh, I hope he rotted in hell. <clears throat> uh. <laughs> oh! Darn, I just forgot. I just remembered. Nathan! Remember when uh, Lon woke up in his room yeah. and uh, Dulpe mentioned that they sent another person? Yeah. To go get help? Who was it? No, like, well, first of all, I assumed you were going to think it was Caleb and ask that, which it wasn't. But it was, that was supposed to, like, become a thing... Like, during the battle. <laughs> Do you want to know what happened? The guards was come and saved everyone? No, Nathan, because being main character is despair. It would have been Tegan. No, Nathan. You didn't let him out of his cell, so they got rid of him. Good. If you let him out of his cell, he would have come to help Nathan. Fuck off. Uh, no, the guy who they sent was supposed to come back, and, uh, like, the mayor would, if he was still alive at that time, or if you recognized what was happening, you would be like, oh, you brought some help from the city, and he would have just given you this look of despair and been like, no. So no, it wouldn't have been anything except for another meat bag to stab into. Meat bag. Meat bags. <clears throat> Anyways. Uh, wait, what was her name again? Uh, name is Marceline. The vampire queen? Oh man, I wanted to make her a vampire. Actually, you know what? Sure, she's a vampire. I will make adjustments uh, later if I need to, but for now, all of her stats are human. <laughs> uh, so she looks at you, and she's like, oh, what, what was she saying? Scrumptious. Hmm. No, not yet. What? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, oh, uh what was her age? Uh eh, she's about thirty. 
I'm only ten years older. No. Mm -hmm. Cougars. Am I right? <clears throat> it's like that one girl in uh, Nuts No Taizai who like loves Gil. Though she's not older than him that much. Like the evil one? Yeah. Hmm. So, uh, the woman whose name you don't know, uh, asks, I assume that they, uh, didn't hurt you too much. I just, I, he, I just stare blankly back at her like, are you fucking kidding me? And because she is super perceptive, or maybe insightful, she looks at him. It's like, what did you guys do? And he looks back at her. It's, uh, and he, his eyes actually look a little bit uh, shifty, as in he like he looks away for a moment before looking back. There were some complications on the job. Complications? Uh, no, no, no. Roll my will right now, AJ. <laughs> uh, roll d twenty. Boop. Fuck it. <laughs> no. <laughs> Is this you talking as Lon right now? Yeah. The complications? Okay. How about, you know, fucking burning my village to the ground and murdering everyone I loved and cared about? <laughs> she, she looks at you. And then she looks at him. <sighs> oh man, now I need to roll against her will. Roll... Wait, GM roll. I can't let you see this. AJ, you I literally just... can decide what you want. Shh. Dude, it's all up to luck. Whether or not okay, he now gets I... obliterated? I, I need... Yeah, it was more of like, does she cast a spell on him in anger, or does she just yell at him? I need to think of what she would say here. Like, what are the words... Okay, she looks at him and like, what the hell does that mean? I told you not to kill anybody. <laughs> and Willem Rose looks back at her and says, as I said, there were complications. Fuck this you, there were complications? This, and then he just raises his voice over yours. This brat over here decided to attack us first. I had it under control until he decided... That he needed to play the hero. Yeah, you know, if I didn't, you know, my friend would have gotten raped and murdered by your orc pals. Are you saying this as, as Lon right now? Yes. Okay. <laughs> she looks back at you and back at Wilmros. <laughs> Where are these orc pals that he's talking about? Oh, I, uh, I made sure they gargled on their own corpses. She looks at you, she looks at you with a nods. Hmm. I approve your actions. Willem Rose. However, this was not the deal we promised. You are getting a cut in your pay. A severe cut. Oh, Rose. no. A severe cut. Well, dude, they were hired to capture you. Went through all this work, they lost some men. Fuck that. Willem Rose looks back at her and just go a severe cut. We could we could help what happened on the battlefield. Plans just go wrong. I lost a lot of men out there in this fight. You lost like three men. <laughs> Do you say that as Lon? Yeah. <laughs> and he shoots a glare at you. <laughs> it looks back. The point is, if we get a severe cut, we're not exactly getting making any profit here. She looks back. Um, well, maybe you shouldn't have burned down the entire village. Maybe there was some sell, uh, some loot available. And then he looks kind of thoughtful. You know what? You're right. And then he tur he takes a few steps back, and he's like, "Guys!" And then you see some people <clears throat> bring uh, half of the force go back to the village loot anything you can we need to make sure that we get some profit out of this 
and yeah, that, that's fine. Go, you know, make sure they're all dead and everything's burnt to the ground. While you're at it, go grab the legendary sword that you know is hidden in the basement. Remote. Uh, do you want to roll bluff? <laughs> roll you bluff. know what? Fuck it. Let's roll a bluff. 16 to uh, 18. 18. Darn, Against... you're so close. However, you do successfully beat uh, the two bandits. Click. <laughs> and then you just start whispering to you, like, did he just say legendary sword in the basement? Dude, I, 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 th I think he did. And they uh, look back at Wilmrose, like, don't worry, sir. We will make sure to scour every inch of the village and bring back anything useful. And he looks back at them, and he it's obvious that he thinks they're idiots. But he just nods, and he's like, get it done. They go off. And he looks back at Marceline. The vampire queen. Walks back over. Well, can I at least get uh, what we are getting paid then for this job? Marceline sighs and then pulls out a pouch and gives it to him. No, that's fine. Do it right in front of me. Yep. Indeed. All right, do you say that again? Yeah. <laughs> They're ignoring you at this point, actually. Probably. Yeah, uh, the pouch is uh, pretty, pretty large. I can even literally though, feel my character's anger right now. Even though it's uh, fairly... Uh, even though she said a severe cut, it looks like he's still getting paid a lot. Person looks uh, back at you and looks back at him and asks... Uh, <sighs> trying to find the words again. Did he, have, did he happen to have a weapon on him? It'd be more useful if he had something he was familiar with. Oh, you know, my sword, which I threw to save my dead friend. She looks at you, looks back at him. Do you know where the sword is? And he looks at her, he's like, Yeah, uh, we found it in the room upstairs, directly above here. Should I go get it? Or should I send somebody to go get it? I hope it's not yeah. stained with orc piss. <laughs> <sighs> she looks at him and she just kind of uh, shakes her head and goes, No, don't worry, I'll get it on my way out. So, uh, she goes off and then just as she's out of sight, she tells Willem Ross, prepare him for transportation. And then goes... Um, Rose goes to the cell door. Say, okay then. Time for you to go with her. Too bad we uh, couldn't get to know each other a little more. I'm sure we could have been friends. <laughs> I put my face right up to the bar. And I'm like, if I ever get free, I'm coming for you. And I'm going to make you gargle on your dick. Uh-huh. I'm very scared. It's too afraid that we probably won't be meeting each other, and even if we do, probably won't even recognize me. Meh, 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 meh. Go to hell. Too late, he's already out of sight. And then, uh, a multitude of guards, along with, uh, give me him, the orc. Actually, you know what? Multiple orcs. Here. There's a... There's a... Okay, I need to refresh the command, apparently. <laughs> this is amusing. I like being I sassy. Mean... So sassy. I really like your say aesthetics. See what I did there? No. Like aesthetics. But sassier. Anyways, copy, paste, okay, couple orcs, couple armed orcs, couple armed bandit, human bandits, show up, and... Do I, rec do I recognize the one orc that I was fighting before? 
can you even tell them apart? I in mean, all I, seriousness? I, I banged him up decently, didn't I? Uh, you have like a scratch or something that I would recognize. That is a good point. You do not see neither of the orcs seem very injured at all. Just the usual, like, you know, yeah, you want to know how I got these scars kind of stuff. Joy. Yep. Yeah, one of them grunts, get out of the cell, look up towards the door or whatever. I Actually, hold my you know. hands up and I walk towards the cell. Uh huh. And? Nothing, I just hold, stand there waiting for them to tie me up. Yeah, yeah one of them ties your hands up uh, through the cell bars and then they open the door and then get you out. Just double, just double checking. Are you gonna be like doing anything? Doing anything? Nope. 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 Just going along with it. Yep. Okay. Uh. So... In my mind, AJ, I'm coming back to this place and I'm going to massacre everyone here. With a smile on your face. Yep. And your weapons description will say, "Here we are." Back again. Oh, oops, wait a moment. <laughs> Gotta get rid of that. Oh no! Oh my god. Okay, give me a moment. You know, I could just take that one. I made him a token? Why would I make him a token? That's weird. Okay, let's see. Uh, reveal. Okay, they bring you over here. This room. Marceline is here. Vampire Queen. Marceline the Vampire Queen, indeed. Uh, various bandits are like station places. And uh, I forgot to do this earlier, but let me take a quick check. Or do you do you care about aesthetics for this room? Don't care about aesthetics. Okay, there is a magical circle on uh, this wall. I don't see any sort of thing that you're talking about. Oh, what do you there mean? we go. Okay. There's, there's a magical circle on this wall. Okay. Okay. Okay, uh, the, this, the, 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 this bandit right here is, seems to be holding your sword. And, okay, they're still holding you and whatever. And, uh, Marceline stands in front of the portal and start, or, the circle, <laughs> and starts chanting, and then there's like a whoosh of magic. And then a breeze starts to flow from the circle, and you see something on the other side of the portal. Something. Something like you, it's kind of dark, so you can't really tell, and hazy. Oh man. It seems like you're going somewhere dark. I'm going to hell. <laughs> now, man, that. <laughs> well, I. <laughs> that place is way better than where you're going. <laughs> yeah, it depends on your definition. <laughs> Anyways, uh, Bandit uh, hands Marceline the sword, and she just kind of nods to him, just like, thanks. And uh, she, one of the orcs pushes you forward, and she's all right, just like... Alright, alright, no need to get touchy, ladies. <laughs> uh, uh, roll, roll bluff. AJ, you remember Shield Hero? Maybe. I'm, I'm starting to feel that vibe. Where it's like, oh yeah, I was totally good, and I totally had good intentions, and then everyone screws him over. I didn't finish, but, uh, that anime. B roll for bluff. Darn. If, if, you, if you had succeeded, or if you had just gotten high enough that I felt like you succeeded, I would have had one of the orcs blush a little bit. <laughs> Because <laughs> that's a female orc. Uh, Marceline looks at you and she's like, 
Go ahead. <sighs> into the void. Into the breach. And then uh, Marceline follows you. And you feel kind of sick to your stomach. To TBH. Hmm. And you are now in another place. Okay, AJ. What? I vote break time. Like? I, I need to pee. Oh, okay. I thought that you meant like end of session time. Oh, God, no. Okay, but uh, by the way, you're going to want to go to the top left corner. Okay. <laughs>